Remind me about my ear protection. Hey folks, Ebbs here with House of Guns, and I have a bolt action rifle review here for you. Actually, the first bolt action rifle review that I've done in quite a while. This is the Mossberg MVP, actually the Predator edition, but it comes in a 5.56 caliber. And if you see anything familiar down here, one of the huge selling points is it takes AR 15 magazines. Now it comes with this little 10 round detachable box mag that seats really well. There's a little bit of play in there, but the bolt operates over it and feeds it just fine. Um, I've actually got a 30 round mag here I'll show you that goes along with it that I've just wrapped in some form wrap. A little multicam there. 30 rounds on a bolt action. AR-15 mag is pretty cool. It's 37 and a half inches overall, so it's a pretty short rifle. This one is wearing the 18 and a half inch medium bull fluted barrel. Has a one in nine twist in 5.56 NATO caliber, which means it's safe to shoot both 5.56 and 2.23 Remington. The one in nine twist is uh, pretty common for AR-15 barrels too, which means it can handle a pretty broad range of weights in bullets. As I said, it is a bolt action. This one has a spiral fluted bolt. And operation is good. It's a little loose, a little bit of play. It's a budget hunting rifle. This is not a precision bench rifle, but it's a little bit loose and it was a little bit gritty when we first got it. Now this rifle has several hundred rounds through it now in the over 300 rounds range, I would say is a safe bet, maybe closer to 400 rounds. So the bolt has loosened up. I love the thumb safety on it. Would remind you kind of of a savage. Very smooth operation. And also similar to a Savage, I'm sorry Mossberg for saying this, but the design is similar. Their lightning uh, trigger system right there. It's got the little plunger on the inside of the trigger. So that's your take up. And then it is really crisp and uh, really clean. This one with the trigger pull gauge mounted on it gets right around two and three quarter pounds every single time. In fact, that was one of my biggest issues with accuracy was the trigger surprising me because it would happen on a, on a five shot group that I would fire for each different type of ammo. I would have one or two shots where just getting used to the trigger, it would surprise me and then it would be off from the group a little bit. It is light and that's how it came out of the box. Now, it also came out of the box very accurate. Accuracy wise, I tested standard full metal jacket, 55 grain, PMC bronze, 55 grain, Tula uh, steel case ammo, DRT, um, dynamic research technologies, 79 grain was very accurate, but then also some hand loads that we do with a 50 grain VMAX, 50 grain Hornady VMAX at about 3,200 feet a second and our group at 150 yards was under an inch. Now, had I been more used to the trigger and been able to handle that take up just a little bit better, the group would have shrunk. It probably would have been more like three quarters of an inch at 150 yards. And that was a five shot group. The magazines, it prefers standard GI mags, which is basically what this is. It's a Brownells mag. Uh, it prefers these. It will take PMAGs, but it takes some extra English not only to get them seated, but it doesn't feed as reliably. So if you're wanting to use your PMAGs with this Mossberg, um, they're going to have to have some modifications. They might need to be sanded down a little bit, filed a little off the top, get creative with it. Um, if you don't worry about 
ruin, or not ruin a $15 P mag to be able to get it to work if you love them that much with your MVP rifle, um, it'll work just fine. The scope that it's wearing is a Redfield Battle Zone, and this is nice. It actually has 5.56 five, adjustment turrets on it for a 55 grain full metal jacket boat tail. So it can actually adjust for drop compensation at different yardages based on where you've sighted it in. Uh, it's a neat setup, well done, Mossberg. Uh, when I think of Mossberg, I think of Mossberg 500 shotguns, uh, not necessarily something that uh, you're gonna go out and be really accurate at, at any type of distance with. And uh, so they came along with the four by four bolt action rifles, and then they've kind of evolved into these. They've done a nice job. The trigger's outstanding, the safety's good, the bolt locks up nice, and it's a really neat handle and a little rifle. So the Mossberg MVP, I uh, hope this was helpful, guys. Thanks for your time. Don't forget to hit like, thumbs up on the video, subscribe, and uh, you can check us out on Facebook, facebook.com slash house of guns. That's H-A-U-S of guns and online at houseofguns.com. Happy shooting, everybody. I hope you liked our review of the Mossberg MVP. Oh my goodness, what is this? I had to adjust it. Oh, there we go, that was, I, I looked it. I looked into it, it was like, I couldn't see, see anything. Okay, safety yeah. off.